Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're gonna go through, as you can tell, lip products. So mainly all of my regular lipsticks. If you guys missed my liquid lipstick declutter, where I went through all of my liquid to matte lipsticks and all of the ones similar to that formula, definitely check that out. I'll link it below in the description box. So yeah, here's all of my lip liners. I don't really have that many and the ones that I do have here, I do use. The only thing that's new from my last uh, lip liner declutter is I do have all of the brand new Wet n Wild gel lip liners and I did do a full review and lip swatches on all the shades. Uh, again, if you wanna check out that review, you're more than welcome to check it out. Uh, but these are really great lip liners. They are retractable. And that's pretty much it. So I'm not really gonna declutter any of these. I haven't purchased any other ones except for our, the uh, Wet n Wild ones. All right guys, so I thought it'd be easier to do this by color category. That way I can lay out all of the lipsticks I have and really go through and see how much I have of each shade. Let's start off and see how we do here and go through the lipsticks. And hopefully we don't have a avalanche problem like last time with the lip with liquid lipsticks. That was not fun to clean up. All right, I'm gonna start with the back row here. So, um, so the first one here is from Madame Glam. This is in the shade Nude 47. And I actually really do like this color. It's really pretty. So, I so I'm gonna keep this one because I don't really have that much from Madame Glam. I think I'm gonna just put the ones that I am going to keep try to keep them together so I still can see which ones I'm keeping and which ones I'm getting rid of. So, so far I'm keeping that one. I'm also going to keep this one from e.l.f. It's called uh, Party in the Buff and this is like the newer Party in the Buff shade. So I'm definitely going to keep that one. I really like that shade. And this one, of course, I'm keeping. This one's from Real Her Cosmetics and I love myself. Love this nude. It's sort of like a shimmery brown nude, but there is a little touch of not necessarily pink, but it's just like a natural color. I don't know how to describe it. Like it's just such a pretty color. That's it right there. I love it. When you guys know I'm obsessed with this lipstick. Um, I wear it all the time. It's so pigmented and creamy. So a lot of these here, like I mentioned, are some of my favorite nude lipsticks. So this is gonna be really, really hard for me. I definitely think the ones here in the front, I'll get rid of a lot of those. But these ones I wear all the time, and as you can tell, some of them are almost gone. <laughs> this is a new one, actually, that I recently received from e.l.f. Cosmetics. They sent me a bunch of these lipsticks, even though I already had some... Uh, decluttered I think before in the past. These are the moisturizing lipsticks. Not my favorite formula wise, but this color is like perfect nude. This is called In the Nude and I am obsessed. This is like my new favorite brown nude lipstick and this is actually a really good one. Some of these are a hit and miss, but I love this one. I am obsessed. I am definitely going to keep that one for sure. Um, this is Red Apple Lipstick in Oh My Guava. I'm definitely going to be keeping that. That's actually in my declutter, so I'm going to move that to the side here. All right, definitely going to keep this one from Wet n Wild. This is called A Short Affair. This is such a pretty, um, like a satin pink. This but one is from Lipland Cosmetics. Keeping, this is called uh, Nakey. I know it's it's a weird name, but it's a beautiful super pale nude. It's almost too nude for me. I definitely need to wear that more often. So I'm going to keep that one. Um, this is from e.l.f. This is their mineral lipstick in, oh gosh, what is this called? Oh, Natural Nymph. These are discontinued, which I'm really, really sad because this is like the palest nude lipstick ever. It actually looks like concealer. Like, look at this. It's so pretty though. It's like a beige fleshy nude. I love this one. All right, so I have um, e.l.f. Cosmetics. This one is called Nostalgic. I'm actually going to get rid of this one because it's like really disgusting and beat up. I will not repurchase this because I found a replacement for it. So this one is going to go bye-bye. It's no good. It's like so beat up and gross. But I found a replacement and this is my new favorite really, really pale nude as well. It's number 11 from Essence and as you can tell it's almost gone because I use it all the time. Another favorite of mine is Matte Innocence from Milani Keeping. This one is from Sleek and I'm going to keep that. It's one of their VIP lipsticks. It's really creamy, really, 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 really pretty. That one's called Private Booth. 
Another favorite of mine is Kat Von D Noble, <laughs> and it's just a little itty bitty lipstick. I do have quite a few of these, so you will see them a lot throughout this video. I still haven't used these up, which is crazy because I actually really like that color. And again, I am going to keep that one because I really like it. <laughs> Another Essence lipstick, this is from their Matte 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 collection. This is in number one, and I really like this shade. I am going to keep that. Alright, this one is in Southern Belle, and I think I'm going to get rid of this one. This is from uh, e.l.f. It's their moisturizing lipstick. I don't know. This one is just too pink for me. I mean, I like it, but I do have a lot of lipsticks. There's a swatch right there. I do have a lot of lipsticks in that particular shade, so I, I haven't touched it since my last declutter, so I think we're going to get rid of that. All right, so, so far, <laughs> we're not doing so good. I'm only getting rid of two lipsticks. I guess I'll just set them over here in my sort of get rid of pile. All right, so here's the rest of my nude lipsticks. A lot of these, like I mentioned, are sort of... I know, they're more of like that My Lips Fit Better type of shade. So let's start over here. This one is also from e.l.f. I have a lot of e.l.f. You're going to see a lot of the same brands. This one is Marsala Blush. I think this is back when that Marsala color was really, really big. I don't know. I just, I never wear this color. It is really pretty though. But I think I'm going to get rid of this one. I just, I never really wear it. So I'm going to get rid of it. All right, another one from Essence, the Matte 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 Collection. This one is in number two. And see, I like this tone better. It's like more of a pinky mauve versus this, I don't know, this one seems very warm. It almost has like a reddish tone to it. So I think I would rather keep this one instead. I don't know what happened to this lipstick. It got really beat up. Do you see like how beat up it is? <laughs> I must have dropped it or something, so I am going to keep this one. Really pretty shade. This color is gorgeous. This is from Sleek Cosmetics. This is their True Color Lipstick in Succumb. I know it's a weird name, but this is a beautiful rich brown. Um, this actually should be with my brown lipsticks, but that's alright. I'm just going to throw it in this video um, with all the nudes. So this one I am going to keep. It's such a creamy moisturizing color. Perfect for fall, so I am going to keep that guy. All right, the next one we have here is from Real, Cos Real Her Cosmetics. This is I Define Beauty Myself. Definitely keeping. This is one of my favorite go-to My Lips But Better shade. And again, quick swatch. Look at that. So pigmented. I love these lipsticks. They're so creamy. These are just as good as high-end lipsticks. That's how good they are. Now, these three here are from Flower Beauty. Um, you can find them at Walmart. It's part of the Drew Barrymore line. These are like all the same. <laughs> like they're all the same. Okay, so these two I think are the same color, which is called Petal. Yeah, Petal Kiss. I don't know why I have two of the same lipstick. But this one I am going to keep. It's a really pretty mauve pink, so I'm going to put that back here. And this one I'm going to get rid of because there's like weird mold growing. Do you see it? Like purpley? Yeah. That doesn't look good, so we're going to pass this guy along to Mr. Garbage. And then the other one from Flower Beauty have is uh, T. Rose. This is another really great nude. I really need to pull this one out and use it. Oh, it's such a pretty color. So, I mean, these are the only lipsticks I really have from Flower Beauty. So, I like to have a variety of brands so that I can do like either a full face of one brand or whatever just to mix it up so I am gonna keep that one um this is limited edition this is from Milani and this is enchanted topaz I can't believe that this hasn't even gone bad I haven't worn it that much but now that it's you know fall season maybe I'll start pulling it out more this is like a true true brown actually this looks very similar to that other one very very similar I think I'm going to hang on to it because it is limited edition and I do like hanging on to my limited limited edition lipsticks. I wish that was permanent, but it's not. It makes me sad, so that's why I don't use it in videos. This one I'm definitely keeping. This is Matte Naked from Milani, one of my favorite nudes. You probably have seen me use that a lot. This one is also from Lip Land Cosmetics. This was limited edition um, collab with uh, Samantha. She's a makeup artist, influencer, etc. I'm sure you guys know who that is. Love this lipstick. I am going to keep it because it's, I, I'm really using it hardcore lately and I'm really sad because it is limited edition, but I'm going to keep that and finish using it. 
and enjoy it while I can. All right, this one is also from e.l.f. and this is, of course, Runway Pink. You guys know I love this one. I wore this on my wedding day. It's very special to me. I do have one more backup. One more backup and that's it. This one's almost finished and I'm really sad because, again, these were discontinued. <laughs> All right, Marc Jacobs keeping. I only have one Marc Jacobs lipstick. Um, this is in the shade... Uh, kiss kiss bang bang. All right, so this one way over here. This is from elite cosmetics elate elate elite elate <laughs> um, This needs to go. It's no good. Um, it smells really weird and the texture is weird I swatched it and it looked really strange. I didn't really like the formula of this one You can feel the grit of the glitter. So it's not my favorite. So this needs to go all right, and then this one I am keeping as well. I know, I'm sorry. I can't help it, you guys. These are like all the ones I want to keep, <laughs> all the nudes. This is one of my favorite nudes ever. This is like the dead girl nude. This is from Jordana. It's the Modern Matte Lipstick. I have a whole bunch of these as well. This is Matte Innocence. Um, innocent? Yeah, Innocent, not Innocence. Um, it's a true taupey gray. Oh my God, there's a swatch there. So freaking awesome. I love it so much that I bought a backup. So this one right here is from Wet n Wild. It's called In the Flesh. And this one, unfortunately, somehow is discolored. It smells weird. I don't know what happened. This is not that old. So maybe I got a bad one, but this needs to go. All right, another one of my favorites uh, from Essence is called Barely There. Keeping. Love that one. I'm just going to set it here to the back. Another favorite. <laughs> I know so many favorites. This is Breeze from Wet n Wild. Really pretty metallic lipstick. Now you guys know I'm not big on like metallic lipsticks, but with the exception of these ones from Wet n Wild, they're so stinking pretty. This is another one from uh, e.l.f. It's the Moisturizing Lipstick in Wink Pink. I'm gonna get rid of this one. I never wear it. Again, I'm not the biggest fan of pink lipsticks. Um, so trust me, when we go through my pinks and other colors, you guys, I will be getting rid of quite a few, hopefully. All right, you guys, we only have three left. Um, this one is from uh, Red Apple Lipstick in the shade Audrey. I never really wear this. It's starting to go bad. I've been trying to force myself to use this one, but it's just so similar to a lot of other lipsticks that I have. There's a little swatch. So I'm going to get rid of this one. So this one here, definitely keeping. I love this one so much that I think, I think, I believe I did buy a backup of this. This is my new obsession. This is called Come Naturally. And this is from Essence as well. I love these Essence lipsticks. Look at that. It's like the perfect purpley mauve that I'm obsessed with. I need more lipsticks this color because I think this is definitely my favorite. So. And this one I think I'm going to let go of. I just, I have a lot of colors like this. This is the matte matte lipstick from Essence in 03. Let's go ahead and swatch it. I mean, yeah, this is like exactly the same as that one from Red Apple Lipstick. It's kind of like in that weird color family. I don't know. I just, I think I'm going to get rid of this one. Alright you guys, so those are all of the ones that I'm keeping and these ones here are all the ones I'm getting rid of. Not much of a difference. Let's see, how many are we getting rid of? Nine lipsticks I'm going to get rid of and the rest I'm going to keep. I think out of all of my lipsticks, these I use the most and reach for the most. So I really don't mind having a larger collection of nudes. Before I forget, I completely forgot about my like tube lipsticks. These were really difficult. I tried to like set them up, but they kept falling over and I knew it would make a big mess. So I have ColourPop and also e.l.f. Cosmetics. So I'm just gonna go through these really quickly. I already know I'm gonna keep Tootsie from ColourPop. That's one of my favorites. I'm just gonna set that down. Um, Pinch, I wear that probably the most. Pinch and Tootsie, I wear all the time. I don't know if you can get those two colors. Um, from e.l.f. T-Rose, keeping, uh, we also have Nearly Nude. I'm keeping that one as well. Love that one. And Natural, I wear that one a lot as well. Uh, we've got Westie, Cami, Oh Snap, and Contempo. Ah, so hard. Alright, we have Oh Snap, a matte finish. Um, this one is really discolored. I think I'm going to let go of this one. It's pretty old. So that one's going to go. And then we also have Contempo, which is another matte finish. 
Uh, I think this one... Mm, I have so many colors like that, so I'm going to get rid of Contempo. Getting rid of these two, and I'm going to keep the rest. <laughs> Hang tight, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. If you enjoy decluttering videos, definitely check out the description box for... Um, I have a whole playlist <laughs> with tons of other decluttering videos if you want to hang out, grab a snack, and watch some more. Definitely do so because I love watching them myself. I find it really relaxing. I hope you found this video relaxing as well. And I will see you all next time. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!